first, first of all, the, the, the visa question. Um, you know that we, we made an important progress recently when we decided to uh, put in place what we call the visa cascade. And the visa cascade is very practical, very useful. More than 99% of uh, the people who apply for a visa cascade, uh, they got this visa cascade, which is very useful and practical. It means that uh, for, for next year, you have access to the, the, the Schengen territory. Uh, in my discussions with um, uh, the leaders uh, in, uh, in various countries from that uh, region, we discussed the topic, uh, the trying to explain what is the decision-making process on the EU side. We are transparent about how we decide in Europe on those, uh, on those topics and I'm certain that many topics will be discussed during the summit and I cannot exclude that this topic, topic could be also discussed uh, during the summit. The second question about the trade agreement. What is the, the, the main message? The main message is very simple. We, on the EU side, we hope, we would like to upgrade at a more strategic level uh, the relationship, the partnership between the Gulf countries and the, and the EU. And it means that, um, uh, for sure, uh, how we can cooperate more in the field of um, uh, growth, investments, economic development, including through trade, uh, will be an important topic. And I'm confident that the message it will send will, will be a, a message of an, uh, an ambitious uh, common will uh, to, to address uh, those um, uh, questions. This is absolutely correct that uh, we started many years ago uh, to, uh, to, to, to try to uh, uh, negotiate the trade agreements. It didn't work, but I think that this uh, political momentum in October in Brussels will be the occasion to uh, express a strong political impetus uh, to renew our efforts uh, to uh, make uh, more progress uh, in, that, uh, in that field.